Hello, and welcome to BirdView. Congratulations on taking the first step to completely transform how you and your team work, managing projects and their related tasks. We will begin with a quick overview of the key benefits of our platform. Let's explore going over a typical project lifecycle, starting with the project initiation or intake. In order to create project intake forms, users require the appropriate role level permissions, which can be found in your company settings. Role level permissions are designed to offer controlled access to different areas of the platform. From a system administrator that has complete control over all system functions, to a project manager that has complete access to all project level data, the collaborator role maintains permissions to specific assigned tasks while having the ability to add their own and leadership maintains a supervisory role. You can easily customize these roles to create new ones or use the existing predefined built-in roles to assign resources and get underway. Under custom forms, forms can be used to capture relevant information about a new project or a change request to an existing project. First, give the form a title and description. Second, use the add field or label to the form and create building blocks. Below this is where you can specify who can access the form. You can assign specific users to be notified when a form is submitted. Head to the top right. This is where you can use the permissions tab to allow guests to access the form via the guest portal or use the HTML code to embed this form into your company's intranet site. You can also define conversion rules if the output expected is consistent, making the process to convert to a project even more simple to manage. Shifting to project planning, project managers can choose to create a project from scratch by simply adding a series of tasks to perform. If projects like these with similar tasks are performed on a recurring basis, you have the option to save these projects as a template. Head over to status and click template down here. The template will also save predefined information such as resource assignments, duration or task start and end dates, pre-assigned to a portfolio, or a unique workflow that this type of product would apply to, and so much more. This is how you pull up a project template. Once you've created a project based on an existing template, you have the option to set the status of the project to draft. This will limit your staff from receiving notifications while you plan out the project, once the project is ready to take flight, you have the option to update the status, and this is when notifications will be sent. The Gantt chart can offer a clear indication of projected timelines, and the option to set up dependencies between tasks or related projects. Click the dependency arrow to set lag days or customize the dependency. With the task timeline in place, you will have a clear visual of your project timeline. Your project will always get its date range from the task dates listed below, starting with the task with the earliest start date, and its end date will be derived from the task with the furthest end date. Every task requires a certain number of estimated hours. These metrics, when captured, give you greater insight into the resource allocation and utilization. The resource loading report offers an interactive heat map of the resources assigned to the project and help you evaluate if they will be over allocated or underutilized and so much more. If the resource is not available, like if they're on vacation, this information is also highlighted on the specific dates. At this point, the resource manager has the ability to leverage the hours distribution functionality to front load, back load, or set hours manually. Now let's jump to project execution. With the project ready and the project status updated to open, your project members will now be notified of significant changes to the task and project via browser alerts, the built-in notifications, and emails. When the project is in flight, a significant amount of time is spent in the activity center view, where we support different types of methodologies. If your project is agile based, use the Kanban board view. This is a very simple but effective visualization that helps you track each of the project activities at different stages throughout its life cycle. You can easily prioritize tasks, detect bottlenecks, and visually see how the task is progressing. The table view is for those projects that follow a specific waterfall-like structure, 
and it allows you to visually see each task with its parent and child task association. As a collaborator or participant, you might be interested in a more focused view. This can be easily managed by working in the My Assignments page right under the Activity Center button. Here you can sort your tasks by those that are currently active or completed, and you also have the option to group them by end date, project, priority, and more. You can also add time entries by hovering over each of the respective activities, or you can leverage the built-in timer. While working on a project or task, communication is key. You can enable the messages field directly in the activity center and access them here by clicking the number or head into the details. And this is where team members can easily communicate, upload file attachments and submit approval requests using the message board. This powerful function allows the ability to consolidate all your communication on a specific task or project in a centralized location, but you can access deeper organization by filtering by only messages, files, or accessing the audit trail. The audit trail keeps track of everything that transpires on a specific task in an easily relatable format. We also support image annotations. If you click on an image, click on a specific area of the image and annotate as required. Anyone with the permission to edit an assigned task or project has the ability to be an approver on the task. This allows the contributor to know that the work they have done is approved or rejected and needs to be reworked before it can advance. This type of approval is also helpful when working directly with clients. If your tasks require you to be away from the desk, we have you covered. Our convenient mobile app on both the iOS and Android platforms offers you a convenient way to manage your tasks, update progress, and track your time all in real time. Let's see how BirdView can help project managers review projects by monitoring key metrics like task milestones, warning of potential delays, or budget oversight. Tasks with specific deliverables and deadlines can be flagged as milestones. These can be easily filtered and tracked in the Gantt view. Capturing the project baseline allows you to see how your projects are trending. You can select the ellipses and access the capture baseline or override existing baselines all in the same spot. This is ideally first captured during the project planning phase. In the Gantt view, you can visually see how you are trending from when the baseline was last captured. If you are required to share project progress with a client or other stakeholders, select Project Plan to capture a snapshot of key metrics like progress and dates based on the Gantt view. BirdView is designed to provide specific warnings to tasks or projects that are at risk or in trouble when tasks are overdue or when the actual spend has exceeded the budget. Hovering over the indicators will allow you to see where the activity needs attention, and you can also snooze these indicators by clicking and selecting a certain time period. On the bottom left, you will see your saved views. The data points you wish to see in the activity center can be controlled and customized to suit your individual or team requirements. If you select fields to display and hide certain areas of the activity center, you can then save certain views by coming up to the ribbon icon and you have multiple options. Save new views, rename them, or share with other team members. But before we do that, let's set some new filters and resize certain columns. And let's bring our estimated to the front by clicking and dragging. BirdView also supports project financial tracking. Go to project details and click the dollar sign icon at the top right to view and set project planned expenses record scheduled payments, or just get an overview of all the current expenses, estimated actual cost and billable in real time. Your executive team relies on pre-built reports and dashboards. In BirdView, you get an out-of-the-box dashboard that covers important KPIs both at the project and portfolio level. You can also use filters to customize your dashboard. Click the green plus icon to add certain widgets. If you require additional reporting, our knowledgeable Power BI developers are available to work with you and build and design such reports that suit your individual business needs. These are often billable based on the complexity and level of effort. While there are plenty more features in BirdView, that concludes our overview video. 
If you would like to learn more and harness all of the power that BirdView has to offer, please don't hesitate to contact a member of our sales team or customer success, and we'd be more than happy to share our knowledge and expertise to better enhance your experience. Thank you for watching and have a great day.